up guys it's Ozzy here so this is a new kind of video for me basically I normally do movie news and movie reviews and some blu-ray stuff but I actually came up with this idea just like a few minutes ago so I thought I'd make the video so this video is based off of the Hulk getting his own solo movie which honestly right now it's not that likely but if it ever does happen Produced by Marvel Studios, this is the story I think would work and would make audiences super, super excited to see the Hulk in a standalone film. So I would want to base the story off of the Red Hulk story by Jeff Loeb. So as you guys have probably noticed in Marvel's Civil War movie that came out last year, General Thunderbolt Ross was actually in it, which was huge because he was from the Incredible Hulk movie. I love this character in the comics and he is actually the Red Hulk. That means that they can potentially do this if they wanted to and if they get the rights for a Hulk movie. With Thor Ragnarok coming out in a few months now, or a little over a few months, in this movie the Hulk is actually a gladiator which is based off of the Planet Hulk story. Now, after Planet Hulk there is a comic called World War Hulk. Now, I can see them doing this at the beginning of this Hulk movie where Hulk basically comes back to Earth and he's kind of pissed off because no one was really looking for him, which you can kind of say is true because in Civil War and every movie since then, there hasn't been any talk of the Hulk. So that must mean that no one's really looking for this guy and that would make me pretty angry. Now having the Hulk come back to Earth and being all pissed off and maybe even fighting some of the heroes would be a great great thing to see on the big screen especially in the first part of this movie and it would be pretty close to the World War Hulk story. After this scene I think it would be awesome to have Bruce Banner kind of locked in a jail which actually happens in the comics. A really really intense jail that's thousands of feet below the surface. I could see them using Thunderbolt Ross kind of being pissed off at Bruce Banner because the Soviet Accords didn't really work. Everyone's kind of doing their own thing now again. So I think it'd be really, really cool to see the Hulk kind of go berserk and then have him realize he's got to do something about the Hulk. He's been chasing him down for years and no one's really doing anything about him. They're letting him be part of the Avengers, destroying things in Africa, destroying things in North America, all over the world, and no one's really doing anything about it. And now he's back on Earth and he's going to fight the heroes at the beginning of the movie, potentially, if this happens. And I think it'd be crazy to see Thunderbolt Ross become the Red Hulk and have them just fight each other in this movie. This would be the number one best scenario for me as a fan because I love this story so much. And I think this would work on the big screen and just be something awesome for the fans to watch. I know there's plenty of other Hulk stories that they could do, but I honestly just want to see the Hulk meet his match. So far, we haven't really seen him struggle with anyone, really, besides the Hulkbuster, but he still technically won that battle. And obviously, he will face off against Thanos, but I want to see someone of his caliber that looks like him and has a history with him, which would be Thunderbolt Ross, just fight each other and on a man, I'm just getting excited just talking about this right now. That's my fantasy for the Marvel Studios Hulk movie. If it ever happens, leave a comment below of what you guys want to see with an Incredible Hulk movie produced by Marvel. Thanks for watching this video, guys. If you guys want to see more movie news, Blu-ray reviews, movie reviews, and other videos like this one, please subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.